Hey guys, today I'm going to be doing a review on Will Grayson and Will Grayson by David Levinson and John Green. Um, this book is about two boys who are named Will Grayson who live in Illinois, Chicago, Illinois. I think one of them doesn't live in actual Chicago, but they live both in Illinois. Um, and they happen to meet in the most weirdest place ever. I don't, I know John Green has talked about it in his like, Will Grayson and Will Grayson video where they met, but I don't feel like I should enclose that, I'm just not going to. Um, and yeah, overall I did like this book, but I'm going to start off by saying I will only give it three stars out of five, if anything. And the reason is, I didn't like most of the second Will Grayson story. Um, there are two Will Graysons, like I said, and Will Grayson one is with a capital, like spelled the right way you spell name, and Will Grayson 2 is spelled with just all lowercase, and Will Grayson 2. I didn't really like his attitude. I know that he was the type of character he was. He was depressed. He was manically depressed. Like, he actually was diagnosed with depression, and, but he was really just not a fun character, and I, he wasn't a fun character, and I feel like if you're reading a book, or listening, I listen to the audiobook version, you don't want a very dull, mean character. Character. I don't know what I was trying to say. Um, but yeah, and that's kind of what the second Will Grayson was. And I really liked the first Will Grayson story. Like, I really liked it. And that's the chapters that John Green did. The odd chapters are John Green, and the even chapters were David Levithan. And I have read David Levithan's book in the past, and I like them, I just never love them, and that's probably why. I'm more in love with John Green's writing style than I am with David Levithan's. Um, it's just a choice. Um, and I really did like re listening to this audiobook in particular because there are singing elements to it. Um, because Tiny, one of the characters, puts on a musical and so they're singing and he also likes singing and because of that you actually hear someone singing and I feel like sometimes when there's song lyrics and someone's singing in a book you can't really imagine it and so that's what I like about audiobooks at times because it's like I can imagine it better because it's actually happening like it's really like it's actually happening like it's not not happening you know that makes sense probably made no sense, but yeah, um, yeah, I really, really like this book, and I, I wish I liked it more, but I don't like it more, and yeah, but I do like all of John Green's parts and all of John Green's characters, um, even though they were together, so it's a good story all together, I think because they do crossover and stuff, but I... Like I said, I really like the drawing me parts better. And I'm sorry that you would love that. Um, but yeah. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this review video. And hopefully there will be a new review of next week on Ellen DeGeneres' Seriously, I'm Kidding. Um, because I'm currently listening to that audiobook. And I'm enjoying it. It's only three hours long. And I'm like one hour and a half. Or 40 or something. It, so it should be quite simple. I should be able to finish it like by tomorrow hopefully so or tonight tonight let's hope tonight um so yeah i'll talk to you guys later and